A SWAT team shot and killed an elderly man in Arkansas Saturday night after an apparent domestic disturbance that led to a standoff. Police were sent to a home in the city of Pine Bluff on an aggravated assault call. 107-year-old Monroe Isidore was reportedly pointing a gun at two people inside. When police arrived at the home, shots were fired at them from someone inside. However, police don't know if the shots were from Isidore. A SWAT team arrived a short time later. Then, the two people who were allegedly threatened were able to leave the house safely before negotiations between Isidore and police began. CNN reports during the altercation, officers were able to slip a camera into a room where Isidore was hiding. The camera helped them confirm Isidore was armed. The negotiations proved to be unsuccessful, so officers took further action. A public information officer told reporters they pumped gas into the room hoping Isidore would surrender, but he fired shots at them instead. Soon after, police kicked down the door to the bedroom Isidore was in. KTHV adds Isidore fired even more shots at officers when they broke into the room. Police fired back and ended up killing him. Although no action has been taken against the officers yet, the Pine Bluff commercial says the police department's policy would require the officers involved to be put on paid administrative leave during an investigation. An investigation into the shooting is still ongoing. Police believe Isidore died from his wounds, but can't confirm it until an autopsy is completed. For Newsy, I'm Logan Tittle.